true. Okay, so then uh, more two point one. Uh, no, the scatter plot below shows the number of heaters. So then uh, uh, let's read the statement first. They yeah. say the scatter plot. Uh, show the number of heaters a company sold a month and the average temperature of the month in a certain year. Both the temperature in degrees Celsius and the number of heaters sold are given in the table. So then we're given a table, we're also given a scatter plot again. Sure. Okay. Number so then we have a question. We have a question in no. Yeah. <clears throat> so number two point one. Number two point one. Barley describe the correlation between the number of heaters sold and and the average temperature per month. Verify your answer by referring to the correlation coefficient. So then, Mister, what I did first, you know, mm. who coach you the information on the table? Can I figure out how to calculate it? Okay. So then they give figure out how to calculate it. They said we should start by giving them the answer without R. even calculating. We'll calculate later, Mara. Let's check. The reason why they say that is because you can look at the number of dots. Ne? If the dots are closer to each other, it means which you are talking about okay. something which is strong. Ne? And then the line can either be it can either be strong like this. I'm a dots yeah. one, they can either be strong like this. Right? So this one it's a positive strong. I'm a dots one, if they're spread, they're further yes. apart, then it means which it can be weak. Right? So looking at this, what will you yeah. see? This kind of trend here. Without calculating, oh, it is strong negative. Yeah, this one it's we we have because the dots are not further from each yes, other. Strong negative because yeah, so we have a strong. Yes. And then we have negative. So we have strong and negative. Now they say we should yes. we should also verify the answer. Now we know the answer is this, but we should just verify it. Most could have calculated it first. Yes. Yeah, you know, you could have calculated it. Madam, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking with the question, the main reason why they asked this question, they wanted learners to identify. Sure they usually give you a trends now, right? yes. and then they say to you, and then you should be able to identify with what kind of a trend. Because who create 11, they ask this question, but they don't want you to use the formula. I shouldn't create 11, we don't do the, the correlation coefficient. But we, mm -hmm. we took scatter plots in create 11. Yes. Okay, what should I do? Okay, so then no here calculate and total calculate. Let's clear the calculator first. Yeah. Yes, restart. Yes, yes. So then mistake. They are going to again. Yeah. Then after to go states. Stats. After states or to go the option in a plus bx, which is option two. Then I'll cover the lab. Two is equal to. Then seven, the, eight. Seven is equal to. 10. 10. Continue. Yes. 18. Yes. Yeah, oh, 18. Yes. 22. Yes. 28. 28. 25. 25. 16. 16. Oh, sorry. 16. 11. 11. Yes. 2. 3. Three. Yeah. And I read the other side. I read the other side. I read the Yeah, come on, move again, Mark. Oh, come on. Mm. All right, come yeah. on. Ninety-eight hundreds, and then seventy-five, seventy-five, yeah. and then sixty-seven, sixty-seven, and then yeah. twenty-four, twenty-four, and then yes. eighteen, eighteen. And then six. six. And then eleven. Six. Six again ways. Eleven. 11. And then foot. Yeah. And then fifty-five. Five. Eighty-eight. Eighty-eight. Ninety-five. Ninety-five. And then we press AC. Then yes, uh, now that we can do the calculation. 
Yes. And then Rara is. So, so then we can put the correlation return she one. Then run by four. Then after a re. And then option five. Then R, which is option three. Then yes. I'll go negative zero comma nine six what what. Then after I derive into two decimal two decimal places, which is zero comma nine seven. Can you still calculating the R? Yeah, we found it. Okay. So R is equal to zero comma minus ne? minus zero comma nine seven. Sharp. Yes. Okay. Next question. So then we are done. So then the next question it says hmm. determine the, 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 the equation of the least square regression line for the data. Yeah. So then Arnello Y, which is equal to A plus B X. Okay. Okay, so we have the oh you you, you okay the, the equation says y is equal to bx. A plus bx. It's a plus bx like this, huh? Yes. Sure. So then just because her name, just because her name is the show more routine method of calculator, it also call out to calculate it. All right, so why is so then to... the so then area will calculate it go shift? Okay, we go to shift. Option one. one, yeah, is yes. relation which is number five, five, then a which is number one. So then our a is one oh four comma seven nine. One oh four comma seven nine comma seven. Yes. Okay. B. So then our B must be negative three. Okay. Let's check our B. So A C again shift one. Y like, it's negative negative zero comma zero comma eight two zero comma eight two. Okay, therefore our equation says yes. y is equal to y one oh four comma one oh four comma one oh four comma seven nine minus three comma eight two minus three comma eight two x. Minus three comma zero eight x eight two. It's three minus three comma eight two. No more zero eight. Yes. Eight two, yeah. Eight two, eight two. It's eight two here, yeah. and then even this one here, it's eight two. And it makes sense. You see our m. This is the gradient, by the way. Remember, ne? it makes sense for the a gradient to be negative yes. because it's a straight line. This thing, the gradient should be negative. So gradient should be positive if you have something. Yes. Okay, yes. let's check. Uh, they say predict the number of heaters sold the number in the month. Where, yeah. Okay, so then more, just because now we are mathematicians, we are going to use this equation again. Yeah. Next, so then we know how we have probably like 20 degrees Celsius, degrees Celsius, so probably like the x. So then we have 20 degrees altitude of x. So y is going to be equal to minus three comma eight two x, ne? which is multiply, twenty. Multiply by twenty. Plus. Plus one o four comma seven seven nine. Yeah, and then it. So then our answer is twenty eight. It is correct. It is different to the one decimal places. Twenty eight comma. Twenty eight. At number of heaters, remember you can't you can't sell 28 comma oh yeah, yeah comma, 28 comma 28 comma 14 28 comma 4 yes. 29 14 yes no it's ah, 28 comma 4 28 comma 4 so it's 29 28 comma 4 it's going to be 28 heaters then so it means which we sold a place yeah remember it because we're talking remember especially with this question this question you need to be you need to be open-minded and then ooh, ooh, if the practical, like it doesn't make sense now, I want. So it can be 28 comma. If you leave it here with decimal, they penalize you one mark because they say, okay, one mark for substitution. But you should know, Woody, you can't have half people. Let's say they were talking about the number of people. Like, Even if we're having 28 comma 9, it's, it's not. Like, you must have 28. Yeah, you, you, yeah, you say approximate. You can approximate it to 29. If it's just 28 comma 9, it's fine. We can approximate it to 29. But then 28. 28. 
Can you approximate it to 29 also? Can I approximate? 28. I am on 28, 0,8. Yeah, this, this one we round it off exactly the, the, the normal rounding off. It's not to say which if it's up yeah, one. We use exactly if it's above five. Mm -hmm. Then we take we can take 29. And then when it's and what, what, what what's key also is this here. Like what's key is this one. It should be a whole now. That's what is key. Okay, because okay. it's the number of features. The 28 and the 29 is subject to, to interpretation, right? Mm -hmm. But I'm sure we know which you know when we're rounding off, there is this thing which if it's greater than five, we take 29. If it's less than, we take right? So if anyone decides to say if it's 28, 27, 8, and then it says no, this is 27 because. This one is not a fully heated sword. So yes, then you can look at Yeah, that's system. what I'm saying. Yeah, they, they won't like they won't penalize you that much because it's subject to interpretation. But we know how to round off. The proper way to round off is okay. mm, I get because we, we know it from financial method. It's not a full month. So it's yeah, no, I get you. Yes, uh, okay, Mr. Here. They say which we should draw the least square regression line and the answer book. Hmm. How did you proceed with that one? And okay, so then that one, Mr. Yeah. Our, our ex me like yeah, 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 okay. mean. Okay, let's go to the mean. It's shift one. So, it's bar. So it's two. It's equals to. Yeah. Then the mean. And then it says which 12, x, comma six seven. It's going to be twelve comma six seven. Six seven. It's approximately thirteen. Yeah. Okay, yes. it's fine. So then our uh, y. Yeah. Why mini is equal to let's go to the calculator. There are no I mean why mean are now which is fifty-six comma four one. Fifty-six comma four one, which is approximately fifty-six. Eh? Yes. Okay, let's go and look for it here. X is twelve. So then yes, when X is twelve, you are not thirteen basically, not twelve. So it's one, it's two, it's three. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Where is it going, this thing? It's going to 56. 56. It's for H12. So 156. So it's 44, 48, 52, 56. Okay. It's, it's just below here. Ne? 56, yeah, it just has to be here. Ne? Okay, what else are you going to do? Yeah. So then more after the goes the market, because I'm gonna check out more our ex. Yeah, we can come and put zero here. Yeah, one so, so then get look at 104,7 something yes. which, which is approximately one into 107, 105. 105. So this is 104. Yes. So 105, it can be somewhere here. Okay, then we can connect the two dots. Straight line. Yes. Straight, straight, straight. Yeah, in our exam, we just have to use a rule. Right? And we could have also taken another point here. This is very important because people think you should only take this one. You just have to have the main point. That's number one. Right? You can take 25. You could have said when X is 25. What? Okay. When X is when it's X is state, you could have taken any other one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, calculate the standard deviation of the number of heaters sold. Number of heaters sold. Yes. So then that one mistake. Which one? Why one X is like standard deviation. We're looking for the Y standard deviation. Which one is it? This one, six. Six, six. That's why. I'm just not bad now. Stats. Mm. Yeah, this test was not bad. Thank you, bro. 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 It's 34,12. 12. 12. 12. Okay, 34,13. Okay, 34,13. I started deviation to the spread. It doesn't have anything to do with it, so you can leave it as... Just decimals. Yeah. Just tells us about the spread. Thank you, Mr. Rahut.